Hello everyone, welcome to Bargaining Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. Uh, this is episode 34 of Dark Souls 3. Uh, here, let's see if we can take on that monster at the top of this tower. So this is our first go at him and uh, hopefully... Uh, I'm not sure what we want to do. Can we... Uh, Shall we do our sorcerer kind of deal or should we just be... Let's try our sorcerer if we can rather than doing our... Uh, wow, that guy looks like he has a lot of reach. Okay, uh, anyway, what we can do is pull him towards this area. Whoa. Hey, this is a... I... Ouch. Ooh. Guy has Ouch! Uh, we cannot trade blues with him. Ow! I can't believe this. I had to grab two. Whoa. Okay, we've dealt with this guy before, I think in the Souls One. Stray Demon. Anyway, <laughs> wow, we used up all uh, six of the our. I wonder if. I wonder if a, a melee guy would have an easier time with him. I didn't realize he has a uh, a range attack. That's why I thought you know, uh, our being a sorcerer would uh, would not be too hard. Because we are just all, all we have to do is keep our distance from him. But he apparently has a a uh, a range uh, attack. So I'm trying to see how do we, can we get up there. There are no broken walls, so that's why the key would be to look for broken walls, or maybe we need to let him. Oh, maybe break a wall. So that we can go out there. I, you know, yeah, yeah. See, there's a ledge behind or below that one. So if they broke that wall, then we can drop down to the next ledge. You know, uh, that is sometimes, that is very, what do you call this? That is very uh, tricky of software developers. Sometimes they think up all these really, really... Uh, interesting ways of uh, hiding items and or ingenious ways for the uh, for the player to reach those places and then uh, they have a really nice uh, item uh, for us to find because he has this big axe so that means we have to tempt him uh, close to the wall uh, pray to the old wolf of Farron. Oh, this I think is in Dead Souls 1 and 2 also. And uh, this wolf was uh, had a sword in his hand of one of his, of his master. And uh, he used that to... Uh, yeah, uh, we had to kill him, I think, to get that sword. Uh, but that's... I, I can't remember. I think Dead Souls... Probably one. I can't remember. Uh, yeah, I, I played those games in New Game Plus, Plus Two, possibly up to four. So I played those a lot, but uh, 
I can't remember which one. So I'm it oh it's all mixed up. But like this straight demon demon, I think was also one of the bosses. In either I think one. Oh I, there are so many bosses. <laughs> so and I think that one also has similar to the uh cursed rotten wood. He will jump up and uh create an area effect by uh using his rump to crush us so uh that's why if we keep underneath him that's what he will do to crush us to uh force us to get out from underneath him so but this one has range i don't remember the stray demon has range he just has a had a very long reach anyway so we are here up here i don't think it's good idea to go down this because there are slimes waiting on the bottom of the uh, of the ladder so I think let us travel to the keep ruins Wait, how many souls did that uh, stray demon give us wait did we get a soul or do we get uh, a uh, a weapon let us check I can't I have such a short-term memory loss or I was just too excited I was you know just 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 winning the fight uh, I was all I cared about <laughs> okay uh, did we let's look at the soul so this is the soul of the boreal vort the soul of the rotten tree wood crystal sage Hey, we got a soul from him. Okay, so he gave us a soul. And then Wolf's Blood Sword Grass? What is that? Proves a watchdog of Farron has met their duty. Ooh, I don't know what that means. Uh, okay, in terms of weapons, uh, Irithyll Straight Sword. See, we can. Now we can use this. Uh, and it has uh, frostbite, right? Uh, the problem is we we need twinkling, twinkling titanite to improve that. Deep battle axe. This one has uh, dark. Uh, so anyway, oh, uh, I th I think this is the I think I don't think this is the right place we want to be. Anyway, let's see. Might as well take this thing down. I think that's a free, uh, what do you call this? Okay, uh... Where is it going? So uh, its pathing is problematic. So again, we get a free free hit on his back. So why not? We'll take it. Well, not bad. They're three eighty five. So they're pretty good. Uh, okay. Um, can travel to Farron's Keep and there is uh, there is a coal that we have to get and uh, it will give us a uh, ability to infuse more types of uh, equipment and uh, that is because when we started exploring this the Farron's Keep we did not explore much on we went back there, right? We we did not hug the wall on this left side. So this is something uh, we can do. Uh, uh, I hate this poison. Uh, it's no fun. We can <laughs> right? We always have this problem. Okay. Uh huh.
key is just to get out of here really quickly. You know, uh, wait, wait, I think the coal is supposedly guarded by something that is uh, pretty strong. So maybe it give it might make sense if we if we put on our uh, silent ring. So we are not uh, I, we are not trying to gather souls here. We are not th this this ring is very good for farming. So, but we are not farming here. We are so this would be a good ring to have because it masks our our footsteps. And then let's see if we can change this to the hidden body, right? So that we can disappear from sight. So hopefully, you know, as a sorcerer, we are we are we're trying to play as a sorcerer. So we're not we're not trying to play a melee type here. So if we can avoid a guy, we'll avoid a guy. See, these guys give us only what 60 points of uh, 60 souls, so that not very good. So, like we're tra tra traveling quietly, so these guys can't even hear us. Okay, and then it will be somewhere here. Uh, maybe we have to take some poison. How about let us? Uh, I can't see him. I can't see. He's supposed to be. Oh, there he is. Oh. Whoa. I hope he doesn't see us. Nope. Well, he did not see us. That is pretty cool. That's the sage's coal right there. So we can backstab this guy. Let's see if we can kill him. Uh huh. Wow, he has a grab. Boy, this guy is tough. Ow! Dark Sword, Crack Red Eye Orb. Whew. Not an easy fight. Not an easy fight. Uh, of course, uh, we are a hybrid, so in terms of pure uh, melee, we, we cannot stand up to him. So let's check. Since we're poisoned, we might as well check this part of... Nothing, right? Oh, we're carrying 17,000 souls. What's this part?
Oh, I see that guy. That's the guy that is... Uh, so we have explored this part because I, the guy that's standing right there, we backstabbed him earlier also. So, uh, so this part we have seen. Okay, let's get out of here. We've been to that part. Just trying to check what areas we have not explored. They're not giving us good, uh, <laughs> they're not giving us any good, uh, what do you call this, uh, soul, so there's no point, uh, working with those guys. Let's travel to the Keep Ruins. So we still have the third, uh, chamber to open. Wait, uh, I think our, our bot, okay, uh. I think there are a couple of items or a couple of stuff that we have to... We still haven't opened the third house, but that's what I'm... That's something we should try to do. Uh, I think... That, should we just take out these guys? Two on one, not good. Not very good. We didn't do that very well. Uh huh. Oh, they have packing problems. I just wish this. This is perfect. <laughs> They're having problems. Oh, they can hit us through the wall. poison oh thank you what did they I think it must be a grew shield or grew sword grew shield I think it's this side that we have uh, we need to explore on this side See, we opened two doors. Uh, I mean, we lighted two items. Uh, two lamps. I really dislike this. <laughs> this swamp. Oh, there, there are a couple of giants there. So, uh, is that the way to go? Uh, okay. You know what? Should we replace one of our rings? Let's replace one of our rings with the uh, poison bite. Because uh, apparently we are, the higher our resistance, we are not, you know, the effect of the poison is not as great. Hopefully.
there's another one. I thought there were three of them. Oh, there's the crab. That's the last one right there. You know, past that crab, remember I... We were being hit by giants or uh, like some kind of uh, explosive arrows. Like the guy, the giant in the... Uh, in the undead settlement where he was helping us. Trying to see for the third. Where the third light, third tower is. So we've lighted that tower. Or maybe we need to get rid of that crab. Oh no! Can't believe it. It is now on top of us. Whoa! Jeez, he hit us. Can't believe it. He hit us. Okay, now it's our turn. What? Fair, he didn't climb that thing and we cannot. I don't believe this. Maybe we should uh, do what we did in the uh, swamp. Oh, he cannot pass through. Okay, that's the way to do it. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> okay, man, that was tough. This this crab is so we can we can pin him between those uh, the tree and the bridge. And let's see what's over on this side. Nope, nothing. Okay, so we have been to this side. Okay, that is the... Oh, okay. I see the... Uh, I do see that there are some giants on that side. Like that guy.
Oh oh. This is deep. not after you we don't we're not interested in you uh, oh we're almost out of so we came down from those stairs so that part is what we have not really examined so when we kill there's another guy over there. Where is the third tower? I can't see it. Anyway, uh, let me cut the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you will join me in the next episode. Bye!